I think that Paul George, I think he's the obvious um, headline here. There's like myriad possibilities. And we don't know right now if he's going to opt in, opt out, um, stay with the Clippers, uh, get traded to the Warriors or the or sign with the Sixers or um, sign with the Clippers or there's there's a mystery team he'll he'll opt in and be traded to. So I think that there's just a lot of uh, uh, mystery and and wonder, and I think that also Paul George is a little. Is it fair to say he's kind of like underrated as like a like a very 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 good basketball player? If he were to go to the Sixers, I just think he's such a a perfect co-star like absolutely he's just yeah he fills he checks so many boxes and there's so few weaknesses and i think that that is really 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 important and he's been through no fault of his own because of Kawhi leonard's knee miscast over the past couple of years or past few playoff appearances um and so you know the bubble was the bubble <laughs> it's like a million years ago and i it's like kind of irrelevant to me but I think I, I see more about like his age and the contract and stuff. And I'm like, yo, this guy is so awesome. He's like an awesome player. It's not saying I would give him a four year max if I sure. was the general manager, but um, just as a player for next season, I think he can still swing a championship race. I think he's still that good. The fact that, I mean, we've, we've talked about this a number of times, Jake and I, and on other shows, like you have to assume at this point the fact that he is not re-signed with the Clippers indicates that the Clippers have yet to be comfortable enough going to the fourth year, right? Like the idea being we gave Kawhi three and 150. That's where we want to keep you as well. And him being like, I don't love, I'm not comfortable in that neighborhood. I would not like that. So I believe, I firmly believe that the Clippers would, or that the Sixers rather would go to the fourth year. It just does he want to go to Philadelphia. I, I think you're absolutely right to say he fits so perfectly between what Joel Embiid and Tyrese Maxey. If you are Paul George, do you want to sign up for another uh, knee haunting fair, situation? Fair. Um, fair. You know, to move across the country to do that. I think that's a big question. 